rounds. Kickboxing according to K1 rules in the middleweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. He weighed in at 86 kilograms even. Fighting out of Vienna, Austria by way of Albania, Labinot Zakai. And his opponent fighting out of the red corner with a professional record of seven victories and four defeats. His official weight was 85.3 kilograms. Fighting out of the Trojan gym in Pula, Croatia, he is Tony Mikulic. And your referee in charge at the bell, Milan Kranchet. So Milan Crunchy, as he's known to his friends, Crunchex. A friendly, fabulous referee. Fighters. Brings the fighters together. The final words. Okay. No, Before the bell rings, is okay. Take the referee. action starts. Here we go. George. Judge, 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 thank you for the first round. Fight! So both in orthodox stance. Mikulic holding the centre of the ring, wearing the red gloves. Solid low kick there, coming from the blue corner. Labbing up with very heavy hands. Stop. Looking to clinch. No Referee there, very okay. quick to stop the clinch, of course. Knees are allowed, but without the holding. Nice fluid boxing combination there from Mikulic. Simultaneous low kicks going. Big right hand there from Mikulic. Labinod in, the, in survival mode. As soon as he saw that punch, went in with a flying knee straight after, wasted no time to try and capitalise on that move. Turning back kick, oozing confidence now. Early doors in this first round. Labinod trying to get a, a foothold back on the fight. Mikulic being very composed, very gradual pressure. Chopping in with a heavy right hook. Tony Mikulic very accurate with the hands. Picks his shots really well. Showing good defence work there as well. Labby not coming out, coming back with his with his own combinations, picking his shots up and down the body, boxing to the head, boxing to the body, working the low kick back up to the body. Nice high kick, yeah. heavy heavy kick, and returned. Turned into a great fight. Yeah. Nice three-punch combination and a nice left body kick to finish off there from the Albanian. That fast right hand for Mikulic. That fast right hand for Mikulic is probably going to catch, catch up with Labino if he keeps dropping that left hand. And Labino keeps having these little bursts, doesn't he? And he puts yeah. in a good combination with the hands and legs, but then look at that. Well, then his hands drops down his, his hands. waist and then... He, you can't, you can't do that forever. But he drops his hands and moves back in straight lines. This is what allows Mikulic to, to chase him down. Mikulic has got great footwork. Well, that was a good round. Both fighters had the moments in there, but I think the man who capitalised more so was this man here who's just landed that right. Jump near as Mikulic tries to capitalise on that success. And then just got a little bit over eager. 
threw a little bit too much into that kick, threw him off balance. Well, it's a 10-9 for me for red corner on my unofficial scorecards. That's what me and Richard tend to do sometimes, just to give you guys a little idea about the scoring system. If there's a knock, knock if I had to get knocked down, it's an 8-8 eight, eight round. 10-7 and two knockdowns, and there is no three knockdowns in one round. It'll, the fight will be over. So Maladen pushing <laughs> the ring corner, man out. Only got one minute, they get 10 seconds to get out of the ring. At the end of the minute, round two. So again, we drop back into that tempo. Lebby not looking, be looking for single leg kicks or fast boxing. Mikulic looks to get his foothold back into the fight again. Because as he was as he was dominant at the end of the first, he was looking to capitalise on that. Going into the second, but Labinot had different plans. Nice boxing, head and body. Oof. See, he makes him pay the price, doesn't he? The minute he throws his techniques, Labino, he drops his hands. At that moment is when Tony Mikulic capitalises and throws very accurate punches. Yeah. I mean, luckily, Labino has got a chin for now. But for how long? Some fast chopping low kicks here at the start of the second round. Labinot needs to be very careful about moving his head to the outside. Because I think Mikulic has seen already that he could be stepping in with that left knee when he slips the jab. Again, back to the low kicks. Again, he does that little rally, but then pays the price. Like, like that. that. <laughs> <laughs> Nullifies the flying knee. Just a little slip. One minute remaining in round two. Two minutes have gone. They've had five minutes of combat so far. Scheduled for three threes, nine minutes in total. Some good graceful movement here. This is the this is the artistry of K1 kickboxing. The switch of stands from Labinot. Yeah, Labinot going, like you said, into south pass, switching back to orthodox. Nice turning back kick coming in from Tony Mikulic. But again, again, backing off in straight lines and allowing Mikulic to chase him down. Good strong block. No loss of balance. Fast hands again by Labinot. Coming back into the fight. And a nice little trade off in the last 10 seconds. A nice little rally nice. from both guys. Nice grandstand finish. Yeah. <laughs> Brilliant. And again, this very seasoned, educated crowd here at the, on all the FFC shows. They know talent, they know technique, they know heart, just like we saw with the last fight. They were, you know, the guy who was getting pretty much mullered the whole fight and the crowd were behind him and not just for the fact you know that, that the guy was you know losing they weren't just trying to build the guy up they were actually you know it's an, almost an appraisal of, of his efforts and the crowd do certainly know here when action like this unfolds and it's appreciated I think that's uh, the, the the first round has to go to Mikulic the, the second round, I'm going to give to Labinot. Yeah? I, th wow. yeah, I, th I think he came back a oh, lot Actually, yeah, the, yeah, you did the, have a lot more the, work rate in yeah, that. With the, with yeah, I can work see Work rate and volume. I can see how you've got to that conclusion. I'm, you know, I'm going to, I'm going to go at evens on the second round. I'm going to go 10-10. But I could see how you, you, would go, you would go that way because he had a better work rate in that round. But, yeah.
So we're into round three. Of three. Again, the fast hands from Labino. And Mikulic just kind of soaking it up, just sitting back, sitting back and waiting for him to burn himself out. Again, Maladen having no nonsense when they go to clinch to keep the fight flowing. Nice sharp jab there from Mikulic. And nice, nice reply from Labinot. Oh, Labinot does have these moments, doesn't he? Yeah. But then takes a big shot at the end of it. Seems to, seems to be par for the course every time. It's like throw six to land one. Yeah. I think it, in this last one minute and 50 seconds, it's, a, it's, it's, it's really a question of who wants it more. Again, that heavy low kick. And you can see the redding on that leg, which is, well, actually started in the first round. Yeah. But he's showing pain, and that's not a good sign for a fighter. Labinot been very cautious over it now, looking to protect it, dropping his weight onto his back leg, looking to shin block. Going up head and body. Good boxing. Well, there's still over a minute remaining. And now, if he's going to go for that leg again, yes, he is, but he's managed to do the shin block. Thai shin block that uh, stops the kick. So at least he's defending intelligently. Runs straight onto a jab. Oh, and turning back kick. Big spinning back kick. No, spinning, oh, so a spinning hook kick, actually, wasn't it? Around the side of his head, yeah. Yeah, the heel <laughs> he kind of connected. Yeah. Spinning back fist. Nice footwork here by, by Mikulic. 40 seconds left. He's going to weather that storm now. Last 20 seconds. Spinning back kick. Wow! Well, he's been not just gesturing it, but he's been throwing that all night, and there's only 10 seconds left. The bell's going to go any second. There it goes. Wow, well, that's closed the deal. So if you have any doubts whatsoever... Well, that was a good fight, Richard, wasn't yeah. it? Yeah, very good. Very I enjoyed good. that. That was actually... Are we allowed to enjoy it? We certainly are. That's all right, then. <laughs> <laughs> this, is, this is, despite it being work, it's, you can enjoy what you do. It is. Well, it's not work, is it? Work's a four-letter word. This is, this is actually professional pleasure. <laughs> Privileged. That's the spinning back oh, kick there. That's the well, heel sank into the liver. Oh, that is perfect, isn't it? Look yeah. at that. The whole side of the foot, the heel, right into the midsection. And that would have folded a buffalo right on the money. He has a spinning hook kick as well, showing his dexterity. The man from Pula, Croatia, Tony Mikulic, showing fine form. But I tell you what, Lavinos Zikai. A gallant runner-up. All three cards favour your winner by unanimous decision, Tony 